friends welcome to cfd for engineers youtube channel in this uh, mesh tutorial series we will move further after uh, after creating mesh we need to go for edit mesh and after edit mesh it is ready to go for output it means we need to uh, export this mesh into fluence so for that purpose what are the settings that we will see today so the first one is uh, output solver uh, here is the list of different solver available uh, in uh, fluent or uh, uh, available in a uh, different software so but we are uh, we will going to export this in fluent so you can see different fluent v v4 and v6 so i will say v6 then common structural solver here i will select ansys okay so these two settings are very much important if we miss this then we uh, it will be very difficult for us to generate a mesh file so you can set as a default and say apply so this is the first step where we need to set our solver it is called as solver setup okay in which we will select a solver type and common structural solver so solver fluent v6 and common structural solver is ansys then we will move for second step where we need to see the family boundary condition in which you can see volume we have two volumes the fluid one and fluid two one is a hot fluid another one is cold fluid then again if i break then inlet and outlet is mentioned again i will break then hot inlet and hot outlet is also there so likewise whatever the boundary condition you will going to uh, apply in a fluent before that we need to define on the surfaces such type of uh, label we need to give so that it will very easy to recognized uh, in fluent or it is very easy to give boundary condition in fluent so for that purpose you can say accept it so it is a second step third step uh, this solver has no parameters it is about the parameters uh, whatever the solver we have select that is fluent v6 it has no parameter so then go for next write input in write input uh, it will ask me to save so i can save first i need to save the project then it is a project once i can save it i can replace then it used to ask me to open mesh file and after that you can queue output file extension that is uh, fluent i can say uh, geometry mesh heat exchanger so i can say hex heat exchanger so likewise i will give the name so that it will be very easy for me to recognize where it is okay so i have so now uh, it will give us message that you have successfully written the mesh file let's see yes done and done with done with translation when this message will come then we can say that we finish our activity so it is all about the mesh export to the different solvers so thank you and have a nice day